decided to do something a little bit different this time. We looked at our analytics and uh, from you guys, and you have your favorite guests, and we have a few of our favorite guests and supporters. And today we're going to be talking with one of our favorite guests. Being our first guest here and also being one of our first guests ever. And it's been a while <laughs> since we've talked to you, so maybe you can uh, give us an update on what's going on. Absolutely. You in, in your life? I talked with you all originally because um, I had developed Parkinson's disease and was taking rock steady boxing classes um, to combat my symptoms. And I believe at that point you were focusing on people who were involved in the martial arts as a way of, of helping them with their disability. And um, I kind of fit the bill that way. I had been... Um, taking rock steady boxing classes for a while and 18 months after i started taking those classes i became an instructor for rock steady boxing also you've obviously been able to do that quite a bit you know from the beginning of this um having a progressive disability is not easy you're constantly having to readapt your what you can do and of course that uh that affects other aspects of your life as well but you've said you've certainly been able to accomplish that well thank you it's been a gift having an opportunity to learn that skill because i think it really has helped me in other areas of my life that have nothing to do with parkinson's just as I'm getting older, you know, some things become harder for me. But then I discovered that that just by shifting my attention a little bit, I can see all sorts of new things that I can do that I wasn't able to do before. And it makes life fresh and fun, even in the midst of change. I think we get conditioned to expect that change really comes down to loss and that it's kind of intrinsically tragic. And what I'm discovering is that change has its own blessings. And it's it's present in everybody's life, whether they have a disability or not. We're going to all go through changes. And if instead of, of focusing on the losses, we have an expectation that there are going to be new things opening up that were not possible for us before.